Welcome back to another video. This is Xenio Sralambus and in this video I will explain you where you should use high repetitions, also known as lightweights. Anything that is more than 12 repetitions is considered as high repetitions. So before we start this video, if you are a new viewer to my channel, make sure you subscribe and make sure you also turn on the notifications by clicking the bell next to the subscribe button. I upload videos every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. So before we start this video again, I want to make a disclaimer that there are many people out there that they think that high repetitions should be used for cutting or basically to tone muscles. So if you are one of those people that thinks about this, then this is wrong. Yeah, actually, it's bullshit. Just to explain you in raw words uh, what it is. It doesn't exist and it's not the way for you to lose fat and uh, lose more weight. You should not be doing high repetitions. The first reason that you could use high repetitions, also known as light weights, you can use them in circuit workouts. Sometimes when I do these circuit workouts with a lot of giant sets, I like to use light weights and high repetitions because of the intensity that I can bring to the workout. Yes, I can do this with low repetitions and high weights, but it's preferably much better to do it with high repetitions to increase the intensity and burn more calories. No, 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 it doesn't help you to burn more fat. It just helps you with the intensity of the workout to, for you to burn more calories. That's it. It doesn't have to do anything with uh, fat loss, okay? Second reason that I will use light weights or high repetitions, I will use them to improve my mind-muscle connection. So when you take light weights, you can focus more on the form of the exercises that other than do other than doing stupid movements with heavy weights. So that's one of the other reasons I will use high repetitions because of the form, the technique, it's much easier to learn, especially if you are a beginner, and that's it. Now the third reason that I will use light weights, aka high repetitions, only if I am injured. If you are injured, I will not advise you to go to the gym and take heavy weights because you will injure yourself more. Personally, when I get injured, um, I don't stay home. To be honest, I never got injured, so, because I know what I'm doing at the gym, but who knows, maybe someday I will get injured. But if I don't feel well, or if I'm sick, what I do, I go to the gym and for the entire week, I do high repetitions, light weights, because it is much better, I feel much better, and I also get the workout done. So this is the third reason that I will only use high repetitions and light weights. Now the fourth reason that I will use, which again is very important, is when you are on a progressive overload program, at some point you will reach strength plateau and you won't be able to basically go heavier weights on your progressive overload. So this is what we call deload week and in the deload week usually what I personally teach to my clients is to do a full high repetitions week and usually when we finish the high repetitions week and also with light weights by the way just don't forget this then at the week after then they get stronger so this is also known as deload week now it depends from you sometimes you need only one week of deload sometimes you need two weeks of deload sometimes you need maybe three weeks of deload in order to get your strength going up again now, this is something that you have to test with yourself and with your coach, of course, which probably knows more than you. So this is the only reason that I will use lightweights, high repetitions. I don't want to see this bullshit again on the internet or anywhere else that, oh my God, I'm doing high repetitions because I want to tone up or lose more weight and fat. This is bullshit, okay? This is not how you lose fat. How you lose fat is by being on a caloric deficit. And to be honest, it is much better to do heavy weights and low repetitions for fat loss because you are also maintaining your strength and muscle mass rather than just doing the uh, high repetitions and light weights. So that's it for this video guys, I hope you enjoy it. If you have any questions, comment them in the comment section below. Make sure you follow me on my Instagram, I upload every single day my food, my workouts, so make sure you follow me there. And I'm going to see you again on the next video. Throw it in the garbage. If you have chocolates, ice cream, and something that you cannot control yourself from it, just take it and put it in the garbage. This is my best advice to you. Personally, I live by myself. It's much easier to do it uh, if you live by yourself. If you live with your boyfriend or you with your girlfriend or maybe with your parents, it's much